How to crutch it on Facebook running solar from Algo Affiliates? Since Facebook became extremely strict with their ad policies, many affiliates struggle with finding good offers that are profitable and do not lead to account bans. White Hat lead generation is one of the top earning verticals on Facebook these days, and you don't have to worry about account bans, moderation problems, and still have great ROI. Now there are many different niches in the lead gen vertical, such as insurance, mortgage, home improvements, etc., and in our experience, home improvement offers such as solar panels are working extremely well on Facebook. Algo Affiliates is the leading performance marketing network, and they have a huge selection of white hat lead generation offers, such as the top converting solar offers in the U.S. right now. This offer is guiding homeowners through the often complex process of selecting a rooftop solar system. Their service allows consumers to compare and save when making the jump to solar. So now that you know which solar is working very well on Facebook, now let's get started with this guide. And let me show you everything you need step-by-step step to create successful campaigns promoting this solar offer from Algo Affiliates on Facebook. Finding the best target audience using Google Trends. Review using Google Trends what the top five states are that are actively searching for solar panels. Go to trends.google.com, select the United States, then type in relevant keywords, for example, solar panels, buy solar, order solar, three different keywords that have buy intent. Set the date range to past 12 months. Then scroll down until you see the top five U.S. states that show the most interest in solar panels. After you identify the top five U.S. states, talk to your affiliate manager at Algo Affiliates and ask them to send you the zip to range E to target which is the zip range that the solar lead gen will do best in, since in their coverage area. Finding creatives that work. The strategy that always works for us when we are looking for creative ideas for our campaigns is using Adplexity Native to spy and see what kind of creatives are doing well on native traffic sources and then adopt them to Facebook. So first, we need to find the best performing solar native ads from the past 30 days. To do this, inside Adplexity Native, we set the date filter to past 30 days and search for relevant keywords such as solar, solar panels, etc. By default, we are going to see the most recent native ads, not the best performing ones. To find the best working ads, we need to sort them by receiving the most traffic. Then take the ones doing well on native, and then create variants which are localized, so a local state per city imagery or flag, or other stuff that people can identify with, and create your ads for Facebook. Here are some of the best performing solar native ads right now. So you can do the same thing I did here, Find the best performing native ads using Adplexity, then make notes for yourself and create your own creatives based on those. Of course, you could use Facebook spy tools as well or Facebook ads library to see what others are running. But we found this native ads spying strategy is better because our ads are going to be much more unique and unique ads always work better. Algo affiliates also offer you creatives you can use. You can also use these and mix it with your creatives. And you can also change the images, for example, to create new variants or add this text to the creatives you already have. The key is test as many variants as you can. The landing page that comes with the offer works very well, so I think there is no need for custom pre-landers for this offer. However, if you still want to test some pre-landers, you can find the best ones in Adplexity. How to set up your campaign on Facebook. Follow the usual process for creating your campaign. Go to Campaigns, click Create, and select Conversions as the campaign objective. Then fill in the usual info needed, such as your campaign name, etc., we are not going to set a campaign budget this time because we want to set the daily budget on ad set level. So just name the campaign and click next. After that, select website as conversion event location. And you need to select your pixel and event or create your pixel if you have it already. Make sure to place your pixel in your landing page. Or if you don't use a custom prelander, then you need to place your pixel inside your Algo Affiliates account. Your pixel should fire purchase page view, initiate checkout, lead and other events. The more events will feed your pixel with more data, which equals with the better results. The next step is creating the ad set. You need to name your ad set and set the daily budget. Always start testing the good structure on Facebook. Set the ad set daily budget to $20 test per day per US state. Never ever group states together in one ad group. Always create a dedicated ad set for each state you are testing. So basically start with $20 per day per ad set. In the audience section, you need to select your target geo, which are specific US states in this case. Click on Add Locations in bulk. Select U.S. Postal Codes and add the zip codes from the list you got from your Algo Affiliates Manager. You can also create another ad set and target the top five states you found in Google Trends and target those separately. Next step is defining your audience. I usually recommend testing broad since we already target the top U.S. states. 
However, always ask your affiliate manager at Aglo Affiliates. They might have very useful data on this, like age groups, for example. For this, I recommend targeting Facebook only as placement. So don't target audience networks. Start with Facebook only. Then you can upload your ads. Remember, a good structure for testing is very important. So do the following. Have the same ad in one dedicated ad set. And once it's approved, duplicate that ad 2x so there's three ads total in one ad group. Create a new ad set for every single ad image you are testing. Repeat if you are testing different headlines per ad angles. So basically start with $20 per day per ad set. 3x the same ad images in one ad set. 3x the same headline per ad angle per ad set. For the best and fastest results, I recommend starting with five different ads, five ad sets with a $20 daily budget. Then you can adjust and optimize once you get some data. Optimizing and scaling winning ads on Facebook. Once you have enough data, you can start analyzing the performance of your ads per ad sets. Looking at the number of conversions is just not enough. Because if you see one of your creatives got two sales and the other one got only one, it doesn't mean that you should cut right away. Keep an eye on the CTAR percent and focus on the CPC, CPA, and EPC. The ad set with the lowest CPA and highest EPC will be your top ad set. If you see that any of your ad sets have a higher CPC than EPC, you can cut that one and focus on the others. If you don't have enough data yet and can't determine which ads are better, then it means you need more data and testing. For example, if you don't have enough conversions, try to focus on CTR percent. After some testing and optimizing when you find something that shows traction, that's when you need to start scaling it. When you find an ad set that is doing very well, don't rush with increasing the daily budget. This is a very common mistake. If you increase the budget too fast, it will confuse the algorithm and it might kill the results. If you increase too fast, the algo will do everything to make your ad set spend more and will increase the bid and you might end up getting very high CPM. So when you increase the daily budget, start slow with 15%, 25% increase at once. It's much better to duplicate a successful ad set rather than doubling the daily budget. Try combining the two, duplicate your successful ad set and increase the budget slightly on the new ad set and see how it goes. If it's doing well, slightly increase the original ad set as well. Once you see which one of your ad is the top performer, launch a new CBO campaign with a daily budget of $100. Use only the top ad in this campaign and also check the statistics on your previous campaigns and target the top U.S. states only. Monitor your campaign and once it's approved, duplicate the ad set in your CBO campaign 4x so you will have 5 ad set within your $100 slash day CBO campaign. If it's doing well, increase the budget. You can go from $100 to $150, then $200. $250, and so on until it's working well. When you see that the campaign is dying, the results are going down, don't decrease the budget or change the ads. Simply launch another CBO campaign and follow the same steps you did before. Conclusion White Hat Lead Generation is one of the top and safest verticals you can do on Facebook right now. You can achieve amazing results with this vertical if you know how to test and scale, and you don't need to worry about constant rejections account bans and losing business manager accounts. Solar panels in the United States are one of the best working niches when it comes to lead generation nowadays. However, you need to have a good and already proven to work offer to make big returns. That's why we highly suggest working with Algo Affiliates. They have the best converting solar offer that you can run on Facebook ads right now. So don't hesitate, create your account, contact your Algo Affiliates rep, and take the advantage of running solar until the trend is hot. Good luck.